everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm taking your uh, monthly reading for the month of April 2020. This is going to be for the sign of Leo. So let's see what's coming up for Leo people for the month of uh, April 2020, uh, starting in a couple of days. Uh, this is definitely going to be, uh, you know, uh, overall view of the month of April. I will be doing the weeklies as I usually do. Uh, I will try to keep it short, so I might not take more clarifiers, but yeah, I will be adding oracle cards and I will be adding... Um, uh, charms as well so stay tuned let's find out what is going to be happening for you in the month of april um in in all areas of your life uh while i'm shuffling the cards let me remind you it's a general reading it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there so just pick whatever resonates with you and leave the rest for personal readings you can always reach out to me on my email id in the description box you can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings and if you uh, haven't checked my sister's channel you can check that out as well uh I do um uh, you know recommend you to check that out because uh, she is uploading lots of videos around different topics and about lifestyle health and well-being so she's also you know talking about the law of attraction uh manifestation techniques as well or what are the things that you can uh you know work on to have your manifestation coming through easily so you can check out her uh, channel as well so yeah let's begin the reading let's find out what is coming up for Leo people for the month of uh, April 2020? Let's begin. Queen of Cups, Pet of Earth, Ten of Wands, The Hermit, Pet of Earth, Two of Swords. Underneath the deck, you do have Ten of Swords. Underneath that, Six of Cups. Underneath that, Ace of Swords. Underneath that, Seven of Cups. Underneath that, Six of Wands. Let me take one more card from the top of the deck. Let's take one more. Let's take one more. Okay. I feel like you know, somebody's uh, walking away from someone in the, in the month of April. Like, you know, it could be you walking away from a person uh, or it could be a person walking away from you because one person is taking so much time to decide about this connection. Um, for whatever reason, but I do see that there are certain delays which is making you feel like walking away from a person, walking away from something. Uh, the delays, the things that are not moving ahead is something that is that that you hate, I would say. Because with, with the with the stagnation that is happening in your life right now, it is like, you know, uh, it is just getting on your nerves right now. And then you feel like giving up on this person. You feel like giving up on this connection. You feel like giving up on a situation. You feel like, you know, walking away from you from this situation, this person relationship is or could be the best thing that you can do to yourself. You feel like, you know, you are tired. You feel like you are, you know, you are so done with it. You really want to move forward. And I feel like, you know, it's, um, when it comes to the other person, I feel like, you know, the other person is like, you know, in the thoughts, uh, in, in, in the, you know, being in, indecisive, uh, you know, it, the, one person is like, you know, planning to leave this person behind. The other person is like, you know, stuck in their thoughts. It's like, you know, they are not making a move forward. They are not pulling themselves back. It's, it's a stagnant situation that you might be facing in the month of April. Um, let's take some clarifiers here. Let's see what the hermit is all about. I feel like in the hermit energy is the energy of the other person that you are dealing with. Let's find out. You know, it's, it seems like, you know, the other person who you are, you know, are waiting on for, you know, or maybe, you know, whoever the person is, who is um, feeling like walking away because the other person is not giving them what they want. Things seem stuck. Whoever feels like, you know, things are, you know, stuck right now. The other person is um, is dead tired doing whatever they are doing. It's like, you know, this person is really wishing and hoping that they could give what, what you want. But at the same time, that cannot be done right now. It's, it's like, you know, they do see hope. They do see, uh, you know, positivity in this. But it's, it's something very, you know, much out of their control right now. So it's like, um, you know, this person cannot give you what you want even though they, they would love to give you that. But um, but before they could do that, they really have to, you know, um, hold on. Yeah, 
you really have to understand their uh, them you really have to understand what they are coming where they are coming from you really have to understand their side of the story which you are unaware of and i feel like you know whatever the the whatever you are you know whatever that is building up in you um you know and the way you are feeling like moving away from this person i feel like you know, it's all because there is lack of communication between you and this person you are not sure what is going on in them in their life you are not sure you are not aware of what is it that that this person is not giving you what you want so that's the confusion here it's it's like you know you are not communicating you are not t telling each other what's what's going on and that's why you feel like maybe i need, it's better if i move away even though the situation is completely different like maybe you feel like you know this person is dating someone else maybe this person is like you know uh taking you for granted and stuff like that but in actuality things are different here um this person is stuck into something very tiring something very um you know um they would love to get themselves free from it whatever it is they, they are dying to get free from it but they are so caught up in this situation they are unable to do what they want to do with you with this connection so i would suggest you to try to be patient with this person whoever it is if you are on the waiting side you you you, you know i feel like you know you are hurt you are feeling bad because there is no communication maybe you you know when when it comes to you maybe you do have your your um you know your point of view is good enough like you know you you really want you know you would have liked it if this person has told you already that what is it that that is keeping them so busy but they are not doing that which is wrong again you know but but coming back to you know them it's it's like they are just you know so busy with their shit so you really have to understand that um and if and only if you could do that this person is going to be more than happy that you did and just give them the space that they want give them the time that they want and everything is going to be back to normal but i feel like you know it's going to take some time it's not going to come easy it's not going to happen quick but um the more you're going to allow things to happen without trying to freak out at this person or the situation the sooner things are going to happen for you easily and effortlessly let's take some oracle cards now let's see what the oracle cards has to add to the reading deception someone is wearing a false self mask uh in this relationship i feel like you know your fears are deceiving you right now about this person about this connection about the situation like you know it's it's again you cannot get into the depth of what is going on like you cannot see beyond something like you know there is something that you can see like you know with, without having communication with this person you are unable to understand their side of the story you are viewing it as you know from from your perspective you are not able to see their perspective you have no idea what this person is going through and your fears are telling you maybe this person doesn't like you maybe this person doesn't you know love you maybe this person is not interested in you maybe this and that and this and that and this and that so it's it's like you really have to you know be strong enough that you don't let your fear dictate you right now in this situation because your fears are going to be very deceptive they are going to make you believe in the stories that they don't that don't even exist so try to be very um you know um try to be strong enough to not let your fears dodge you or you know distract you and you know make you feel bad about this person about this connection let's take some clarify for the deception though Let's see what the deception is all about. The moon. There are certain things that you don't know about, so you are just feeling deceived by this person. Even though the situation is not at all what you are feeling right now, you you have no clue what is happening. You will start having communication with this person. Don't 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 be upset. Just allow things to happen. Um, you will have the communication coming through with this person uh soon, but. before you could have it you really have to stop letting your fears dictate you in this situation let's take some charms now so you do have two alphabets z and a c so these could be your own name initials or name initials of the person that you are dealing with you do have an ace of hearts there is a strong love there is a strong connection that you have with this person uh but something is there which you are unable to see you feel like you know this person is maybe you know um enjoying with their friends and family you do have usa as well so um maybe your person is living in the usa or maybe you 
your person could be busy with the with some work regarding you know maybe the corona thing happening around maybe they are busy with that um your, your person is not a robot if you if you feel so that you know this person has doesn't have a heart uh they 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 are not giving you what you want they do have a heart it's just that their life has become so busy that they are unable to find some time even for themselves as well so try to understand that they might be having sleepless nights right now because of the world because of whatever it is that is going on in their life like i said they, they are going to you know they are going through something um shitty in their life so you really have to allow them to you know be themselves and try to trust uh and have faith in your love for this person uh things are going to be getting better but i feel like you know it's it's going to take time it's not going to come easy it's not going to happen quick um uh, it it might take um you know 12 days or uh maybe around the 25th of uh, this month uh, for some of you maybe things will start showing up you know in a better way um so so know that you know uh, don't let people around you also deceive you uh, or you know make you feel bad about this connection by you know don't don't listen to other people uh, you know what they have to say about this connection during this time again try to be you know a uh, use your own mind use your own intuitive sense around this connection maybe like you know it's it's again um i feel like you know this person is really uh stuck in something bad very bad and they really want to you know end whatever it is that they are dealing with right now and come to you so just just um stay hopeful stay positive you are you know their sunshine but they are stuck they are doing something like a robot right now like you know they are stuck in something very consuming energy wise and you know uh otherwise as well so you know just just allow them the time and space so they could uh they could happily come back to you once they are done with this whatever it is they are not involved with any other person i don't see that energy at all but yeah um you really have to have patience with this person and everything is going to be good between the two of you again so yeah this pretty much it coming up for you for the month of uh, april um if the reading resonates with you do like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal reading you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you guys take care Bye bye